ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் ஐம் கோபிகா ஸ்டடிங் தேர்ட் பி காம் ஜென்ரல் இன் மகாலட்சுமி உமன்ஸ் காலேஜ் ஆஃப் ஆர்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் சயின்ஸ் அண்ட் ஐ எம் இயர் டு கிவ் ரிவ்யூ அபவுட் த புக் ஆஃப் ஸ்டில்னஸ் இஸ் திக்கி ரிட்டன் பை ரயன் ஆல்டே ஆத்தர் இன்ட்ரடக்ஷன் ரயன் ஆல்டே வாஸ் பார்ன் ஜூன் சிக்ஸ்டீன் நைன்டீன் எயிட்டி செவன் ஈஸ் அன் அமெரிக்கன் ஆத்தர் பப்ளிக் ரிலேஷன் ஸ்ட்ராட்டஜிஸ்ட் புக் ஸ்டோர் ஓனர் அண்ட் ஹோஸ்ட் ஆஃப் த பொட்காஸ்ட் த டெய்லி ஸ்டாய்க் He is a former director of marketing for American Apparel. The reason for most of the problem in this world is the fact that most of us can't be idle in our home or in a particular place. I am not saying this. This was said by Blaise Pascal. Stillness is the key which is about stoicism. A lot of people have talked about it. Being stoic can give us peace of mind. This book talks about how the mind, body, can be in alignment if we follow certain things we can have a blissful life we all know john f kennedy he was in powerful position and had to take a lot of decision though the decision did not affect him personally he had to take decision which often put lives at stake how can person take a decision peacefully john f kennedy had a small note with him he is to doodle the words that came to his mind before taking an important decision during a critical situation he used to chill in the rose garden after making a decision and sorting out the problem the first person he thank is the gardener he say that if there is a space for solitude moment to keep our mind peaceful it will lead to better decision if we want our mind to full be filled with ideas and lot of creativity we have to be idle which would lead to the boredom we should think a lot instead the thought that we have would eventually lead to the great ideas we often get great ideas while we are bathing because that is the probably the only time we are not on the phone or talking to anyone because we might take the phone to the washroom at other time we get a lot of ideas during this time because we spend a lot of time with ourselves solitude is a must for a creative mind a lot of information is available these day but we are not sure whether the information is useful for us or not influential personality know how to filter the information that they receive napoleon had specially instructed the others to not wake him up when there is a good news but if it is a bad news then people have to wake him up this would filter off the information that he chose to receive the next thing is fear of missing out life the pressure of watching a new season of the popular show there is no need for it to be updated all the time it's okay to miss out it's okay to be one or two season begin the next thing is the stay calm beyond the fact that we can hear the world around us when we are calm when we do not contribute the noise of the world we tend to hear a lot of useful things unknowingly the next recommendation is the version of the book show Knowing a lot of things is very important in our life. Even Buddha need a guide. Even we can lead a better life with the guidance of others. The guidance can help through book show or through any other book that you have read. If we keep sealing something our life will be better. If your life is complicated and everything around you is complex. If you feel the people are not treating you properly and if you feel that the life is not fair to you and if you feel that the things around you are not as you want them to be that feel is because of your ego which stop you from doing many things because such people only think about themselves they are concerned only about that is happening to them they are concerned about how people perceive them and respect them as they keep on prioritizing themselves they lost their peace of mind If at all you feel that everyone is answered to you, then it is the right time to check your ego. The next is about what we need in life. We might have a huge list of things that we want. But only when we are convinced to, we can understand the true meaning of life. We don't need many things to fulfill ourselves. All we need is a heart that is content. If you don't learn to be content, then life might be. force you to say that's it enough to some point the next point about soul is that there is a something beyond us beyond the i power there are certain things which can't be understood by us things which can't be explained to us they are things 
and experience which cannot be put into words. They are things beyond our grasping power. If we realize that it will be good for our soul, understanding the concept of soul itself is a big question mark. We have explained about the existence of soul while taking about Osho books. We need not believe what is being told, but you can trust your own experience. All of us have something to contribute to this world. The action of people around us become a chain reaction. So it is important to acknowledge that all of us have a purpose in life and treat our fellow human being in a fair manner. But anyone can read stillness is the key. If you want to implement stillness or stoicism in your life, you can read this book. Thank you.